Thank you for being here, everybody. This is the Mad Salvi. Uh, today is an interesting day. Uh, tonight has been an interesting night in my world. Uh, Niji Sanji has brought out a lot of tea, spilled a lot of tea, a lot of things that people don't like and disagree with. We're going to be talking about them in a little bit. I just want to give you guys a little bit of a reminder to, of course, you know, uh, take all of these things with a grain of salt. They are all my opinion. They are all alleged until they are fully done and finished in court. You know, all those things. But we, we can take a look at all the information that's out there, and that's what I want to give you. Thank you so much. We are going to start out with Lyra Pandora on Twitter saying her things. So here we go. Uh, Lyra Pandora saying, Hi, everyone. Thank you for your patience during my absence. Myself and some others will be speaking about recent situation in 30 minutes from now. This was the video that we are going to watch. And the video says, This video, Niji Sanji talent, refer to a document that was made by Doki Bird, former Silent Taxi, and her lawyers that was given Niji Sanji legal. This document was not to be made public, nor to be shown to other talent, as stated in Doki Bird's response. Now we're going to take a look at, of course, the stuff that goes on here, and I will come back at the other side. Holy moly. Hi, this is Elira Pandora. Thank you okay. for taking the time to listen to us today. Vox and Ike are also present here with me, and we would like to take some time to address the events surrounding Zelentatsky's contract termination. Oh, this is, this is, this hey, is spicy. Hello. This is spicy. Um, to preface, we have discussed with Any Color staff and our legal team about what we are able to say. However, due to how sensitive the situation is, please do keep in mind that there are limits to what we're able to share. Both Absolutely. we the livers and the that. company have been affected deeply and are taking the situation very seriously. Well, I hope Everything they are. that'll be discussed has been approved by our lawyers or is based solely on our personal experiences. Okay, Before anything good. is discussed, there is something very important that we, Niji Sanji Ien, feels need to be made very clear. All of us do not condone harassment of any kind to any of the parties involved. After discussion well, I mean, with the, the members of Niji Sanji Ien as a collective, I volunteered for my channel to be used for this stream. Additionally, we've been told that there will also be a video releasing regarding the situation from Tazmi san directly a few hours following the stream. But what we say on this stream is our own oh, words interesting. and our own feelings. I would like to first apologize if my silence on the matter has caused any worry. Over the past month, staff received documents from Salen's lawyer containing examples of her claimed experiences under any color. These documents in question included personal information of some livers, and when it was sent to us, we learned that there was a potential that this information could be made public. Some of the information poses a risk to our personal safety and puts some of us at risk of doxing. Notably, one section of this document alludes to where Millie and I live. However, oh, no. there are also harmful good. claims Helen made in the document about some livers' personal information that we believe are simply untrue. I felt threatened and scared of speaking out about the situation because of the risk that it could pose to not just my own safety, but the safety of those around me as well. I'm very sad that this is how everything had to turn out. And I deeply apologize oh, wow. to all the fans who have been affected through this time. This really does feel like it's been recorded at gunpoint. It really does feel like management was like, you have to say this. Here's your script. Say this in front of everybody. This is how it really feels. This is just my opinion, though. When Selen had posted the tweet about her cover being privated, several EN members reached out to Selen and we expressed our concerns. We were genuinely concerned and we wanted to understand the situation as we were all in the dark about it. Once she notified all of us regarding her hospitalization, we immediately reached out to her, each other, and her manager to confirm her safety. The manager also immediately reached out to her and her emergency contact and kept us updated throughout the entire situation as well. It's been a very tough time for a lot of us, and I'm honestly not sure what else to say, but... This sounds very AI. It sounds like AI was just told the script and done this. I'm sorry, maybe I'm just being a little too mean to them, but this sounds like AI. It sounds like, it sounds very scripted. Thank you again for everything, for waiting, and thank you. Um, Thanks, Alira. Um, no, no right. worries. Yeah, it's, um, it's and just, now yeah, they're going, now they're going again, and, okay. Uh, and it's had an effect. I've, I've noticed it's had an effect on, on, on everyone. It's had an effect on me too. So It does make Doki Bird look better. It makes Doki Bird look a uh, lot better. Uh, I'm joining this stream to talk about my experiences with Selen, uh, to lend some of what I know to help um, help you all understand the context of this a little bit better. Uh, I know that a lot of you watching are going to have your own views and opinions on the situation. And so all I would like to ask is that you can take the information that I'm going to present at face value if you can. So uh, this recent situation uh, began when Selene claimed on Twitter that her most recent song cover had been made private by staff, and she gave no context or reasoning as to why. In actuality, she had been asked to send the content of her music video to her manager in advance of the release date so it could be checked for content, etc., which is something that all... Oh no, they're releasing information. Ooh, are they releasing? They're actually releasing stuff? Oh yeah, they're, they're releasing, they're releasing deets here. They're releasing details here. Uh, it's a Selentatsky cover video check. Example one. Hi Selentatsky, sorry for the late reply since this video included X livers It will cause more time for me to get confirmation. The audio is okay to me. Confirmation Selentatsky. 
Uh, this video is set to private until confirmation. There's also a chance that you not, might need to adjust it before asking public again. So they're getting just this confirmation that it's because of X livers. This is confirmation that something went wrong because of X livers. It was because Nina Kosaka was there and Mr. Rias was there. It's it, they're really holy crap. This is this is big news. This is humongous. I didn't expect this to pop out today. I'm glad I made a stream though. Jesus Christ. So they're doing this. Because there's no chance that you might need to adjust it before setting the public again. Also, before you post anything to explain about it, please confirm with me. Oh, so they're basically they're basically trying to blame her again. They're trying to blame her again. First, they're saying it's because of X-Livers. The audio seems okay. You might need to, to, to adjust it before setting it to public again. And then they're like, talk to me. And she's like, you just did this without even talking to me beforehand. You privated it. I'm angry. I need this. This is not what I wanted. And there, there you go. Holy crap. This is, this is just, this just made it way worse. It's made it, it makes Niji Sanji really, really, really look like they are inflexible in every single way. Oh my goodness. Agree to do. Her manager communicated with her about this very clearly, um, but she released her cover without giving management time to check it. And as a result, it needed to be made private. It was going. She contacted a lawyer. Well, that makes sense. Again, once the checks are cleared, uh, management absolutely intended to let her release the cover once they'd made sure that it was okay to release. It's very important to establish this pattern of events had happened before on multiple occasions, including her Fall Guys tournament in uh, August of 2023, uh, a voice pack in May of the same year, and an outfit contest also in May. What is going on right now for anybody who doesn't know? Um, Selene Tatsky, you know the whole situation with her. Right now, Nidhi Sanji sent out Ike Eveland. Vox Akama and Alira to defend them pretty much in front of everybody to send they sent the defense squad you know against Selene and they're claiming that she is kind of they're trying to trying to say that yes you know it's sad that she's gone but she's kind of a rogue person she didn't listen to management that's what I'm getting here and that this is like holy crap in each of these situations Selene would be working on one of the projects I mentioned she yes rats are right again clear communication about confirming certain aspects with staff as all other livers receive and comply with and each time she would refuse to cooperate. And when staff would react appropriately, she would make public statements that would hurt any color's reputation. I wish and I was as kidding. situations kept occurring, myself and other livers felt very upset and anxious. We felt that these statements harmed all of us as a group. Oh, excuse me. So they're saying that the statements that she's making harmed them all as a group, and they're all, they were all angry at her, it seems like. It's, they were all disappointed. This, this is just, oh my God, this is, holy moly. So it's this context that I hope explains why myself and some other livers decided to approach Selene and ask about her handling of the latest situation, which was her cover being made private. So some livers, myself included, asked Selene why she tweeted about the cover in the way that she did, uh, expressing that we felt it was unnecessary and harmful. According to Selene's lawyer, it's this event that they claim to be a buildup of, uh, or, and what they claim to be a buildup of past experiences that led to accusations made by Selene that she was bullied and harassed. As you can imagine, no, 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 no. incredibly- Oh, no, 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 no. See, they're twisting it. Now they're saying that Selene was the one who said that she was being bullied and harassed. She just said that it was a toxic environment and a toxic place to be, and that's what caused her to go down. She never mentioned who was harassing her. She never mentioned that there was big uh, bullying. The one who did this, the one who said that there was bullying and harassment, guess who that was? Niji Sanji, directly in their their public statement they said that there that she claimed that there was harassment and, and bullying she in her statement said that there was just a toxic environment so they're 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 trying to throw everything on her they are i'm sorry for everyone who is fans of these but they really just seem like niji sanji attack dogs right Serious. now and i want to state that throughout my friendship with Selene, i did my best to support her in private and talk to her about any problems she might have been having whenever i had the chance Having thoroughly reviewed the documents sent to any color by her lawyer, and based on what I know personally and have been told by Selene as her friend, myself and other members vehemently believe these claims to be completely untrue. I feel very confident in saying um, that the way I and other livers communicated with Selene about this incident was fair and reasonable, especially considering our built-up anxiety over this repeating pattern of behavior. In my opinion, I do not think that it was a form of harassment. If you want to take a look at this video yourself, it is the most recent video called A Message from Nidhi Sanji EN on Elira Pandora's channel. It was basically sent out about, um, as of now, 30 minutes ago. Uh, and it's basically an attack on Selene, an attack on Doki Bird, and a full-on defense. Like I said, they're full-on uh, Niji Sanji apolo apology party and Niji Sanji, Niji Sanji apology people right now. Also, this is bad, man. This is really bad. Lawyer, it stated that Selene had secretly recorded me 
in a private voice call without my knowledge or consent. Now, I have absolutely zero memory of what I might have specifically said in that recording. But what? Now they're saying that she's she's recording them without consent. This is oh my god! They're really. No wonder she's speaking about a lawyer. No wonder that she stopped her stream. No wonder that she's doing all of this. This is utterly insane. I've never seen anyone do this. You no, know, it was on the topic of the tweet that I had made around the time of AR Live's cancellation last year. From what I know, based on this document, uh, Selene had wanted to use this as proof of staff showing favoritism for some members over others, as at the time I wasn't reprimanded by staff having made that tweet. I followed this issue up with my managers and I was told that they didn't reach out because they didn't want to cause further controversy at the time. Uh, however, I've been asked to delete other tweets on multiple occasions when I've accidentally broken a rule. In these cases, we're politely informed that when we should avoid tweeting something, uh, we apologize, delete it, and move on. Now, yeah, she say, he's saying, you know, you, you apologize, delete, move on, blah, blah, blah. And they're basically kind of giving the whole idea that, um, that the way that she reacted was not proper. They're trying to say that she overreacted and the fact that she's getting lawyers involved, it really seems like they are really, like I say, attack dogs for Neji Sanji. And yes, there's Riku Tazami is going to be doing his own thing, but I believe I should react to this as is right now because this is crazy. The real issue here, however, is that someone I trusted and considered a friend not only recorded me in secret, but also that these recordings were held without my knowledge for almost an entire year. Now, yes, I understand that some places in like Canada have a one, cons one party consent rule, but remember when it comes to the rule, it depends on the rece the receiver's rule. Like if I'm in a place that doesn't allow it, but you do, you can't keep it because I can technically, well, I mean, you can only, you can only be sued in the place that doesn't allow it for, right, for as far as I know. Yeah, they're claiming to be friends, but they really aren't. Holy crap. This is attack dog status, really. The fact that this was held throughout our friendship is really upsetting to me. Until now. I Grunkle. Right now, Vox Akuma, Ike Eveland, and Illyra Pandora have made a video on Illyra Pandora's channel basically defending Nidhi Sanji and basically badmouthing Selene saying that she's, you know, she's doing all these things wrong, that they've had those situations before and she reacted wrong, that they received the stuff from the lawyer, all that kind I of stuff. I looked up to Selene as my senpai and I felt really lucky to be her friend. Yeah, they're showing public and private information. They're showing private information that should not have been shown, but the, the Niji Sanji just wants to better their situation, pretty much. Having to talk about this now and seeing how this has played out is, again, heartbreaking. Selena told me privately about her disagreements with staff and her managers, and I had done my best to support her and to help her make what I thought were the right choices, even when she talked about wanting to graduate. For context, leaving Niji Sanji is always an option for Livers. If she had wanted to graduate beforehand, she was given very many chances to do so amicably. And on multiple occasions... Oh, she was given multiple chances to go amicably? No, I'm not going to believe Nidhi Sanji on that. They're saying that she had many chances to leave and graduate amicably? It really did not seem that way with, by the way they treated her. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, this, is, this, is, this is insane. This is just utterly insane. Selene had told us she planned on graduating but would then go back on this shortly after. For example, she told me that she would be graduating on the day we hosted the Prism Cup, but as you know, this didn't happen. She also, after being warned by staff due to her repeated rule breakages in May of last year, told other livers that she was being- So they're saying that she broke many rules in May of last year. I think that was around the time that she was trying to do her tournaments. So basically they're trying to make her into a problem child. They really are trying to make her into a problem child. They're gonna have to have a lot of paper trails because she has a lawyer and she's going to sue now. I do not doubt that she's going to actually le legitimately sue and she should because they're defaming her publicly now. Terminated at that time when, like I said, she had just been warned, nothing else. Because I trusted her so much and I listened to her narrative of half or untruths about her relationship with any color, this caused me so much anger on her behalf that I had considered graduating with her in solidarity. Seriously. X to doubt, my dude. You're getting a lot of money. X to doubt. I will, I will take you at your word if you say that, that's what it is. But there's a bit of X to doubt that you were actually going to graduate with her. It, this, this, especially now, you're showing solidarity now because Niji Sandy's telling you to probably. How come you didn't show solidarity when she was, when she graduated, when she was feeling bad the way that she was? How come you didn't go publicly solidarity? I have a big X to doubt on that one. I'm sorry. And I now know that my intense feelings at the time came from omitted context and falsehoods. And that, once again, is heartbreaking. So he's he's becoming himself the victim now. He's saying that he's the victim now. He's saying that there was falsehoods, that she was lying to him. That's why he was about to graduate with her. That's why he was going to graduate in solidarity. Oh my goodness, dude. Wow. I mean, it could be true. We don't know. Because, of course, as I said, we're only getting this side of the story right now. We need to hear Doki's side of the story in response to this. And Tazumi, the CEO, is going to speak about this. This is how serious this situation is, guys. You're going to have the CEO talk about this eventually. You had these people come out as attack dogs against Selene. It's bad.
it's bad for Niji Sanji, which is I'm glad that that I've been making videos and I haven't let them be the way that they are. I'm incredibly happy with my job, and even in the face of times as hard as these, I really wouldn't want it any other way. So regardless of how I now feel about Selene having been my friend and having hurt me and my fellow livers in this way, her attempt on her life will never ever be something to be taken lightly. I recall the moment when I and, and uh, other livers found out about what had happened, and we prayed for her safety then, and we still do. Look I, I hope that they're honest about this. I, I also don't know. I don't know what to think, but I hope that they're honest about this because, yes, it's never right to get someone to that point. But your company, the company that you're defending right now is the one that got her to that point. Niji Sanji is at fault. Niji Sanji is the one who got her like that. That is the horrible Regardless thing. Regardless of the outcome of the situation, I genuinely want nothing more than for Selene to grow and to be in a safe place where she can look after her health insofar as... I'm getting bullied. I'm getting bullied. <laughs> I'm getting bullied. The rest of Ian can heal in our own way too. To those of you watching this stream, please, please leave her be. Harassment of any kind is vicious and it's insane and it has no place in this community. I agree. Harassment of no of any kind, like don't don't harass Vox, don't harass uh, Elira, don't harass Ike Evelyn, who are going to speak in here, because they are straight up just attacking. Like they they're they're doing what Niji Sanji is telling them to do. So don't that's, attack. That's that. That's all I need to say. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Vox. This is just horrible. Mm. I mean, seriously. Uh, before we round things off, I also had something that I wanted to say. It's mm -hmm. going to be a little bit on the shorter side. Uh, by the way, hi, I'm Mike. Um, <clears throat> first off, I just wanted to say, like, preface this with, like, sorry if I have a hard time finding the proper words for anything. I'm a little bit all over the place right now. <clears throat> Excuse me for a second. For a very long time, I considered Selene as a good friend within Niji Sanji Ian, be it on stream or off stream. We always okay. managed to get on really well. So, um, that's why it was so shocking for me to learn that any color had received these documents from Selene's lawyer. Learning about what was contained within these documents was to me personally incredibly saddening. Knowing that Yes, no doxing whatsoever, of course, no doxing. Um don't don't go directly after the talents. They're doing what their management is telling them to do. They're doing what their company is telling them to do. So don't go after them. Just don't go after them. It's 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 not good. Um it's not smart. It it's 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 definitely you don't you don't want to do it. You don't want to do it. Definitely don't want to do it. So that's all I'm saying. The things This is definitely scripted. The document were coming from the very same person that I call my friend was hurtful and disappointing in a way I really don't know how to describe. So they're talking about a document, I think, from what I'm getting, they're talking about a legal document that she sent to to Niji Sanji, and Niji Sanji spread to the livers. So Niji Sanji, from what I'm getting here, correct me if I'm wrong, but from what I'm getting here, Niji Sanji sent that out to all of the livers, saying this is what Selene is saying about us, this is untrue, and blah, blah, blah. Because this this they're talking about a document that I haven't seen, that um she's saying all these things, and she sent information. So that's what they're saying. Yeah, okay, I got it correct. Okay. Not only because of it made me now re-examine our entire friendship, but primarily because the document... Yeah, it's not legal. It's a legal document. It's supposed to be private. And that's also, it's it's like defaming. It's slander. It's a bunch of things. I don't know if she's going to be able to do anything about this, but this is serious. It contains some information that we believe is incorrect, that could be harmful for us. And it's just private information that is very terrifying to have being, you know, shown before you like that. And yeah, I mean, like, right now, like, like the uh, Noah's saying, they, oops, sorry, 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 sorry. I thought I, I thought I, I thought I paused it. Um. That's what is being said here. It's like, all Doki wanted to do is freaking play Neopets today. She wants to get past this. And no, Nidisani is like, uh-uh. You did this to us, now we're going to do this to you. This is our revenge. This is what it really seems like. Very terrifying to have being, you know, shown before you like that. Right now, we're all very stressed. But in spite of this, I feel like the public deserves to, at the very least, be aware of the existence of these documents, as well as... of as No, no, they don't. They don't need to know about these documents until it's court. Until you're in court, that's when you can know about documents. They don't need to know about this stuff. She was trying, Doki was trying to keep this, Selen Tatsuki was trying to keep this private because she didn't want the, the public to know about it, to, to, to go on a witch hunt. Now what this, what's this gonna do? It's not gonna help you, Niji Sanji. It's not gonna freaking help you. It's gonna hurt you more. So it's the, not gonna so do good. Contents. In spite of this, I feel like the public deserves to, at the very least, be aware of the existence of these documents as well of, as of some of its contents, for the sake of transparency and honesty. We understand that the past week of radio silence has been really difficult for all of you, but please rest assured that we have been working very, very hard to try and understand what it is that we can and cannot say about this. But we wanted to make sure that what we shared 
was as much as we were able to share. Within Niti Sanjay EN, everyone always makes an effort to make sure that anyone who wants to be included in something has the opportunity to do so, whether that be online or offline. And all of us will continue to do our utmost to provide a safe and fun environment for fans to enjoy together. And uh, lastly, to round this off, I want to reiterate, please do not spread hate to anyone involved in any way, shape or form, or anyone in general, honestly. We ask that in these times you allow us to continue our activities without asking us for any additional information about the situation. At this point, it's an issue for the lawyers, and we ask that you do not pressure any of us to discuss the matter beyond this point. Please reach out to any color for contact regarding anything else. And I think that's everything for me. Thank you all for your time. Thank you, everybody, for your time. Thank you. All right, that's it. That's what happening there. And right now, um, this was, this was, this was insane. This whole thing was insane. You're saying that Doki Bird said something? We're gonna go on to Doki Bird. We're gonna go take a look at Doki Bird. See what, if she's posted something, we're going to take a look. Here we go. This is Doki Bird's response to the whole situation that we just had here. To everything that was just said here. She says, I will say that it never supposed to be shown to anyone other than me, my lawyer, and other relevant lawyers. It was private. It was a private document with my own personal information that was used as a legal document to help my lawyer and document my thoughts. It was never supposed to be released anywhere else to any other parties outside of legal department. It makes me wonder if my medical and hospital records were also released without my consent, as that was also promised to me to be kept private. You heard that right. It was supposed to be private. And they unprivated it themselves. They just decided unilaterally to do that, which is not right. And of course, I fixed the, uh, the appearance of everything. But um, this is my final word on this specific thing that we're, we're seeing here. This was not supposed to happen. They messed up by doing this and having Lyra Pandora, Fox Akuma, and Ike Evelyn go in and say this. They had them as their attack dogs. They had them as people who were just like, yes, I'm going to do this master or whatever it is. This is the way I'm taking it. You could be saying differently. You could let me know in the comments whether you see it or, or not this way. They became the attack dogs. They became the faces now of the hate of Niji Sanji. It is very unfortunate for them that they chose this route, but they are adults and they chose it. I do not... I recommend you do not go and harass or bully people because even Doki herself says do not go out harass and bully people because you win nothing. You don't win the battle at that point. You become just as bad as the people you are criticizing. So never ever go and do this. Just make memes. Do whatever you want. Otherwise, other than doing that, don't dox them. Don't do anything like that. Stop watching them. Block them. Take them off of your YouTube. Take them off of whatever and do that for you. This is the Mad Salvi coming back to you and letting you know all of this news that just popped out. Thank you for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. Comment down below because I know you guys are going to have a lot to say about this. Let me know exactly what you think. My uh, my socials are in the description as well, as well as Discord, Twitter, my YouTube. They're here, which is right here. My uh, Twitch, all of that. If you want to take a look, I stream there uh, nearly daily. Let me know as well how you're doing. I want to hear from you guys as well as more videos that are going to be popping up on your screen about things that you might be interested in. Appreciate you. This is the Matt Salvi. I will be seeing you all next time. Bye-bye.